Alrighty, well, hello again and welcome back. Welcome back to my channel. I am Lucky, and today for Let's Try Thursday, we're going to be playing a game called Evoland. This game was purchased by my buddy Panda, who gifted it to me on Steam a couple weeks ago, or shall I say December. You know, how real life can get in the way sometime and slow you down. But I am here today to show you my noobness on playing that game I haven't played before. Alright, so let's start with new game. From what I got from the summary of the game, it's kind of a game that is based around other cult classic games, such as Legend of Zelda and Pokemon, and it's a game that kind of has a lot of, you know, inspiration from all them games, you know, that are based around RPGs. Alright, so let's get going. You got a right key. There seems to be some chests to open this way, so I'm guessing the right key goes for the right chest. Bingo, I was correct. You got a left key. Always going right is boring. I don't know. I like side-scrolling games. Hold on, I need to sip a monster. Alright, so we got 2D movement. That's good. I couldn't read that. You got basic scrolling. You want to see where you're headed, right? I hope so. Alright, so I guess I just keep following the path. This game is chest happy. I can make such a perverted joke right there, but I won't. Alright, you got sound effects. This game is so much more alive this way. Another chest. You got smoother scrolling. We'll save you some headaches. Yeah, because I don't like motion sickness games either. Them aren't fun. Um, nope, something's in the way that way. <gasps> Yay, it's like Zelda. I'm like Link right now. You can. I got a sword so you can kill evil monsters and cut down bushes. Where's the chickens when you need them? Alright. You got monsters. Be careful not to touch them. Can't touch this. Da, 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 da. I don't want to die. I don't want to die. What are them things? Giant ticks or octopuses? Oh gosh, they sound so funny when they die. They kind of look like Mega Man, too. They kind of just look like everything. You got music, Evo Tune, topping the charts since 2012. What's this? Alright, you got save points! My cat's acting crazy. An evolution that changed the game forever. Ah, oh, yeah, some games that you couldn't save back in the day were a pain in the ooh la la. Especially for people like me who die all the time. It's like they designed it just for me. Alright, so we got some cacti. What's over here? Woo! Oh my god, color! You got 16 color display! It's like Game Boy! Game Boy color, that is. <laughs> Got your giant tick boy. Over here we have some more bushes and a rock. Can't move that yet, I don't have a Pokemon with that skill. What's over here? Oh, more giant ticks. Die! <laughs> Either that or they can be like giant brains. I don't know what they are. Oh my god, what is that? Alright, let's go the other way. I'm too scared to go this way. I don't want to die. Do you want me to die? Thumbs up this video if you want me to die. Alright, let's see what's over here. Oh, a bridge. And another chest. You got a star. Collect all the hidden stars in Evil Land. You got the card bat. A new card to play Double Twin. That everything that you like open sounds like you really got something good. I guess I'm gonna have to go the way of the bat. Alright, let's go be brave. Gotta go kill Batman. One of the few remaining members of the Order of the Dragon Knights whose purpose is to trouble the world to help the needy and fight evil. Those centuries of peace clearly mean you haven't had a whole lot to do recently, but it looks like business is picking up again. So is that a hint that, like, retro video games are in now? Alright, you got storyline. This plot is so deep and rich. Okay, so we got 
got some more cactus and some more like brainy guys. Shoot, I forgot to. Come here, mister. Gotcha! Woo! Better colors! You got 256 color display! This is almost like real graphics, isn't it? It totally reminds me of the Game Boy Advance. Alright, so you know what? I think it's time in the Let's Try Thursday videos that we do a toast. This is a toast to an awesome Let's Try video. So grab that beverage of choice and have a toast because you are awesome. Yummy, yummy. Ugh, I love monster. Oh my gosh, this bat's haunting me. Alright, come here, Mr. Batty. I'm just gonna run. Ah! Alright, you got a sign panel. Luckily, it seems your hero knows how to read these signs. Alright, this path is reserved for Agile Adventurers. Agile Adventurers? Okay. I totally know how to read English. Oh, son of a gun. I don't like these tick octopus things. They have tentacles. Ah! Alright, I guess I should, like, go explore a little better. Horrible adventurer. Ooh. All right, you got free movement. It looks like it's time for some action and adventure. Ooh la la. All right, the access has been blocked by the dimensional stone. Try the path to the east. To the east, to the east. So I have to say, this game is really cute. I like the aspects of it. I like that it, you know, is inspired by other games. Like a history lesson in a video game. Good choice, Mr. Panda. Good choice. Can I go through this way? Oh, yeah, he's skinny enough. Alright, so game saved. You are saved. Oh, what? Okay, what are them things? Are those stone men? Okay. What's this? You got an inventory. Click the icon and use tab to open it. Alright, so it looks like we have a sword, a star, a card, no gold. Alright, so that's pretty simple. Oops. So I'm guessing... I don't know how to kill these guys. But I'm guessing we have to kill them. Okay, so you shoot... you poke them in the butt. <laughs> Come here, little guy. I want to poke you in your tushy. Another thing that I can make like a horrible perverted joke with, but I won't. I'll refrain. Just keep this G-rated guy. Game over. Good job, Lucky. Good job. Alright, let's try this again. Hopefully I don't have to like go all the way back. Alright, so it saves me at least. That's kinda nice because I die all the time. So it looks like I have to poke this guy in the butt again. Ah, oh, son of a gun. I gotta get him in like the right angle. Oh my gosh, I can't make jokes and play games at the same time. Now I gotta breathe. Okay, let's try this again. Poke! Any day now. I think I gotta poke him three times. Move that tissue around, mister. What are these things? Like stone men or <gasps> You got path on lines. Killing all the monsters will sometimes help you on your quest. Good job. And I got inventory again, which I've had. Okay, so let's see. Sorry, my cat's distracted me. You got overworld. Exploring this world is always nice, but beware of something. I damn cats. They always get in the way. Alright, another chest. You got turn-based battle! Yay! It's like Final Fantasy. Let's change to a different fighting style. Okay, never mind. Um, it's like Pokemon. Attack! Attack! Yay! You won 50 kills? Good on this journey. I'm proud of us. 
Sorry, my proud of me. Oh no! Alright, yeah, this is just like Pokemon. Look at it, it looks like a Pokemon or a monster that was made out of bubblegum. Yeah, mode 7, it looks like real glorious when it was introduced back in the 1990s. Oh no! Another bubblegum monster! What's items? Potion? Sure! Yay, I'm healed up again! Alright, you're good! or whatever is, like, the money in this game, or the currency. Let's go over here. Poor chest! You got places names. You will learn the names of places you travel to. Alright, so this game, I have to say, is really a game that I could really get into. I love games like this. Oh no, not another stone butt monster. But it's a game that I could totally play, like, all day, and then totally bore you guys and gals all to death. But I just wanted to say, um, I'm really thinking of doing some Let's Play videos with this game because it's, it's so fun. I really have enjoyed it. I like that it brings back all the memories of all my favorite cult classic games, and I like the play style of it. But as always, be nice, keep gaming, much love, and I will see you around. If you like this video, totally thumbs it up. And totally, if you're not already, subscribe because I love you and I hope you will love me. I will see you around. Bye-bye!